Rock the Casbah. What was that from? I remember. Hello? Oh, I see. Welcome back to Contrast. That's what it was called. Now this works. Um, how far does it go though? This is going to end this week, by the way. Okay. Can I shift into the banister? No. Fucking banisters. I found out this game is actually very short. I mean, I already knew it was short, but... Shorter than I expected. This is the final chapter. Act 3. She needs to see stage 3. Huh. Huh. Speed run. Sp speed run. I wonder what a speed run of this looks like. A lot of this, probably. A lot of dashing. Look at all the stuff up here that I can nick. Picture of a girl's shadow beside a woman walking down the sidewalk. Yep, that's certainly what that is. Cheers. Oh, never mind, that's a quest thing. I saw the blue light in it, thought it was another note. What the fuck? Tesla coil, zap the girl. She's in the disposal chamber where everything gets vaporized. And then you can breathe the fumes after she gets vaporized. Do I? I don't know. No, I guess I don't need to bring a box up. I wondered if that laser was going to keep all the stairs down now. I guess this is a job for me. Use the light shining on the... get the light shining on the stage. Here's where all the bloody notes were. Lecture by Dr. William James. Investigations into the multiverse. What the fuck via mystical experiences? That's a load of bullshit, that is. What the... The picture blurs before it unblurs. Yeah, they're all over the place now. Newspaper article, missing illusionist sought in affair of missing assistant. Oh dear. That's illegal. Ooh. Is this going to be temporary? Yeah. I can't do that. Or do I turn it back off? I don't know. I guess not. Oops. Whoa. Easy enough. Picture depicting the shadow dimension's effect on the world. Shadow dimension? What's this suddenly? We're getting plot for the weird shadow stuff. Uh oh. Laser zap. Science picture. Ah, yes, a shadow. Wait, we're we gonna get a story for who or what I am. Picture projecting skeleton to a shadow. What do you mean skeleton to a shadow? Do you mean projecting a skeleton's shadow? Oh! I wanna go out there. There's a box and everything. Just what everybody wants in life. Oh great, more of this, eh? The cogs of life. The gears of war. Am I allowed up here? The wheel in the sky keeps on turning. It doesn't, though. Uh, oh, bookkeeper. Picture of Vincenzo and Dawn, Exposition Universal. Is that me? 1900. I'm only missing one note. I probably missed it in the circus level, maybe. I need a box. I think the bookkeeper achievement is for getting all the notes in this chapter. Hello? Fwoob. 
Right, although I didn't I don't think I got an achievement for getting all the things in Act One. I don't know, but I also didn't get one for Act Two, so it must have been one of those. Oh. How convenient. Isn't it just? Not really, no. Wait, what? How's this supposed to help anyone? Like that, I guess. Ah. Hello? Um, I don't exactly know how this is going to help me. Ah! Scared me! I don't know what this has done for our hero. It lets me walk across there with the box, but I need to get the box up here first. Um. Anything else? I guess that's yeah, that's the end goal of the box. I don't understand how I'm supposed to get the box up from here though. I'm not. Would that work? Probably not. If they intended you to do that, they'd let you see the bottom of the light properly. What if it falls out of the shadow into the pit? That might work. No. Well, very much not. Um, the puzzles have got an immense... Big puzz. Who turned the lights off? Can I only have one on at a time? Yeah. That doesn't help anyone right now. <clears throat> What does that do? It just turns the second one on. What's this? No, I can't use that. Or can I? Not really, no. Hello, it's me! What the hell, I've got two shadows. What's that? Why does the crack go away? What does that do? That turns on this one. Or whatever. Stop camera. Hmm. It it's like this is supposed to come down somehow. But it doesn't. Can't bust the wood. Buster Rhymes. Yeah, this just doesn't make sense to me. I can't do this. It does go higher, but... Guess I'll try this again. Whoa! No. 
because I won't be able to walk up that. I'm pretty darn sure. Wait, what was that? Wait, focus? Oh. They've added a new mechanic suddenly. Without tutorialising it. I guess they didn't... Did they tutorialise anything else? Maybe. Isn't this already focused? No. We're gonna have to drop the box right here. I can oh. I see. I can just carry it along. Whoa. That's pretty fun. Pretty fun indeed. The sparklies are there though. There you go, your new home. Ugh. It's too bright. Twonky Nopkins. Get in, I'm pressing the button. Not at the right time, apparently. Thanks. Uh. Uh. I'm going up. What's up here, eh? Are you coming home? I don't know. Did I miss the story now? Or was that all? Maybe that's all it was. I don't know if I want to be here. There's probably no point looking around anymore. Oh, how did this happen? The simplest walkie platform. Whatever. Ooh. Oh, thanks for the arm. Need a hand? I don't know. Because she smells. Proby. Ugh. Now this is more my speed. Jitterbug. Yeah. Well, this doesn't work, does it? His head's too round. Oh! What the? What did I land on? There's something magical there. Why is everyone's head so round? Who designed humans? Yeah. You got that right. You're a bit of a plonker after all. Huh? What the? It kind of reminds me of Alan Wake now. Got a bit wacky. Not quite this wacky, maybe. Eviction notice. That's a big letter. Uh oh, final boss arena. Where's the stage? There, apparently. Have I done it? Have I saved the day? Let there be light achievement. How did I get down here? May the show and go now, on. Ladies and gentlemen, the amazing Vincenzo's Theater of the Unreal. Oh yes, please. Unreal. We'll what? I got ladies the light on. And Bitch. A physicist named Albert Einstein tells us yeah. that our universe may not be the only one. Oh. There may be infinite others, each slightly different from ours. There is. There's a universe where Doom was never made. 
may be reality in those to citizens of these other worlds Whoa. we are shadows you mean dragon asses exist in other worlds this appears to you to be an ordinary box no it doesn't it's but a it shadow is actually what we call a tesseract or an octocoron suppose i open it not in the three dimensions we live in but along its fourth dimension oh the fuck? I can take out surprising things, Weirdo. things that are familiar and yet strange. Who's that? What's that? Imagine a world where shadows can interact. But in this world of shadows, what seems familiar may be dangerous. Oh my god, Gremlin. Kill it. Look, it's too big what now. Good. Can hurt you. Oh dear. But what frightens you can also turn into something of surpassing beauty. Whoa. Understand. Whatever that was. What a show. Thank you. Hmm. Thank you very much. Hey, you're welcome. Goodbye. What the hell can I do that? Maybe in contrast to which doesn't exist, I don't think. Yeah, that was pretty spiffy. That was all that work just for that. Oh, bye then. All right, see ya. Hello. Hi. Oh, there is a reason you can go over here. What are you up to, Jordan? You're up to something. Up to no I good. I really tried. Mom was right. I made a lot of promises I couldn't keep. What is yeah. with you? Without you, I'd be in the river. But it worked out, Daddy. I nearly got you hurt, kiddo. Why, it's me. You would have saved me if I needed it. Hmm. I did it all. Why don't I get any credit? Because I'm not in this world. I'm out of this world. Uh, Mr. Drakaya? I've had just about enough of you. I've done had enough of this. Will you do a playthrough of Out of This World now? Nah. show? I want you to meet the little girl who turned the lights back on. You made the lighthouse work? I fixed the puppet show. No, too. you didn't. And the pirate ship. You fixed the pirate ship? It was me over it there. Was a little broken. See? She's almost as smart as you. Smarter, she's actually. Brave, too. What's that supposed to mean? That you're rich, famous, and afraid of a little girl. What? what would you have me do, Mr. Fenris? Take her on my world tour? Take her to Shanghai and Istanbul? She'd and probably enjoy that. And dangerous cities as some sort of filthy. Is, is that what you came here to propose? Daddy, no. no. Why? I don't know. Just Dee Dee deserves better. They both deserve better. They need you. I think they need you. Me? I'm a walking calamity. No, Daddy. You're a you walking your dead. Life to be with them. Johnny, what did you do? He nearly got himself killed to get you back. I wouldn't do that for anybody. But I'm just gonna keep screwing up. I yeah. Fix things. You got a point there. Would you take me back? For good? Nah. Oh, Johnny. God, she can't resist. Oh, you broke them. You killed would you like them. To see my workshop? Oh. Again? Yeah. I bet you get to Shanghai on your own stage. Yeah, probably. Oh, you'll figure something out. Hi. After all, you are my daughter. I'm just happy to be here. Oh. How'd you do that? I thought only Dawn could do that. It's been a long time, hasn't it? What the hell? Thanks for taking care of Didi. Yeah, I guess so. I don't know what's going on though. Oh, there you go, Finn achievement. Uh, well, obviously, uh, yeah, I've got all the thoughts swirling around right now, they need to form sentences so they can come out, but yeah, it was pretty cool, interesting gimmick, mechanic, whatever, um, when it worked, I don't know, it probably always worked, just, I don't know. That bit in the room with the turning gears that I was stuck on for like 10 minutes was a bit dodgy, like it kept pushing me out, but otherwise I guess it made sense in some places, probably. But um, 
But yeah, All right, it, it kind of feels like they could have done more with it in a way, I guess. Like, the game feels too short, like they could have done more with the gimmick. But it was probably more about the story than anything. That was a pretty good story, I suppose. I guess not much happened, really, but... It was, I don't know. It was enough. Yeah, I would have liked to see them do more with it. Just imagine all the things you could do, all the shadow weirdness and cleverness that you still could have done. But what was there was pretty interesting. Um, it's got a nice visual style as well. Like the stylized characters and stuff. Um, and the shadows animate and interact with the world quite cleverly. Like how the shadow and the real little girl interact. Um, it doesn't tell you where you've missed things. Oh dear! Um, audio. Voice acting's alright. Music's alright, I guess. I don't know if this is a real song. I hope not, otherwise I might get DMCA'd. It's not my kind of music, but... I don't really have any complaints about the about the audio or anything. And yeah, I guess I've already talked about the gameplay. It doesn't even tell me which act is which. God. I can't believe it. We'll always have Paris. I assume that's just the one I did. Why is it called We'll Always Have Paris? Dunno. Yeah, it is. Bum. Um, overall, probably give the game like a, I don't know, a six or something. Six for me has kind of historically been a bit of a more on the meh side, but still, it's above half. Maybe I should just stop giving numbers. They don't really mean anything, do they? Like, they kind of do, because, you know, people always say don't. there's no point giving numbers because they don't mean anything, but what they do mean is the, the opinion of the person who's saying it. And, you know, sometimes people care about what number someone would give something. If you care about my opinion of games, but I don't know, I feel like most things I just give them 6, 7 or 8. So there's not really much interest, much interestingness. So maybe it's better off if I just say like my overall thoughts than give it a number. But yeah, I pretty much said what I thought. A decent little thing. Wish they'd done more with it. Because I feel like they could have. But yeah, no complaints really, I guess, other than some, some janky interactions with some of that platforming towards the end in the shadows. Uh, yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Um, goodbye. That's one of the shortest playthroughs I've ever done.